Hello, so today I'd like to share a simple thought that I've been thinking about this last week and it's from Elizabeth Elliot. So a while ago I listened to a podcast of hers about guidance and I think she was talking about like when you're afraid that you're going to make a wrong decision. And so she was talking about the verse, what time I'm afraid I will trust in thee. <clears throat> and she said how like being afraid is something you feel, but, but then it says, what time I'm afraid, I will trust in thee. So what you do is an act of the will. So we can't always um, help how we feel, like we can't always help feeling afraid, but we can choose what we do when we feel afraid. You can choose to trust in God. Um, and I found that a helpful thought, not just about being afraid, but just all the different emotions that we feel sometimes. So we can't always, we can't always help feeling sad or feeling down or feeling disappointed or frustrated um, and there's lots of other emotions that we can feel but what we can do is to choose we can choose what we do and often when we choose what we do then our feelings will change to what we are doing um, so <clears throat> I've been thinking about some of the verses in the Bible that talk about I will so Psalm 69.30 says, I will praise the name of God with a song and will magnify him with thanksgiving. So we may not always feel thankful, but we can choose to praise God. Um, another one is, I will hope continually and will yet praise thee more and more. Psalm 71.14. So we might sometimes feel hopeless, but we can choose to hope in God. Um, Psalm 71, 16 is, I will go in the strength of the Lord God. I will make mention of thy righteousness, even of thine only. These next two verses, are um, the psalmist was saying this when they were feeling discouraged. Um, they said, I will remember the works of the Lord. Surely I will remember thy wonders of old. I will meditate also of all the work and talk of thy doings. So it's a choice to remind yourself of what God has done for you in the past. Psalm 57 2, I will cry unto God most high, unto God that performeth all things for me. Um, oh, and then Psalm 56 3, what time I'm afraid I will trust in thee. And then Psalm 118 verse 24, this is the day which the Lord hath made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. So we can't always choose how we feel, but we can choose what we do um, when we're feeling however. And one thing we did in the holidays, I took my children to the Masterton, Masterton swimming pools, which I'd never been to before. And I hadn't realized how scary it is with Lydia because it's like a whirlpool, which she loved going in but I ended up getting in with her because it was just too scary because it was quite deep on her and she would just get like sucked along with the current. But I was thinking how our feelings can sometimes be like that current or that whirlpool. It's really hard to go against your feelings. So if you're feeling down or you're feeling depressed, it's hard to be thankful and to sing because you don't feel like it. And we just tend to want to do what we feel like doing. <coughs> But um, yeah, and when we choose to praise God, when we choose to be thankful, it's like we're turning around and going against the current, which is sometimes very hard to do, which it is hard to do. But when we do that, then often our feelings change and follow what we do, follow our will. So this is an encouragement, however you feel, to choose to do what's right, to choose to praise God, to choose to pray to God, to choose to rejoice and be glad. And then our feelings usually change too. And also in the Psalms, there are a lot of promises where God says, I will. So I'm just gonna read out a few of these. Psalm 48, 14. <clears throat> this God is our God forever and ever. He will be our guide even until death. Psalm 32 verse 8, I will instruct thee and teach thee in the way which thou shalt go. I will guide thee with mine eye. Psalm 29 11, the Lord will give strength unto his people, the Lord will bless his people with peace. Psalm 9 verse 9, the Lord also will be a refuge for the oppressed, a refuge in times of trouble. 
Psalm 88, 10, open thy mouth wide and I will fill it. Psalm 50, 15, call upon me in the day of trouble, I will deliver thee and thou shalt glorify me. And Psalm 34, 11, oh, this is one of the other ones. This is another good one about what we should do. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. So no matter what we feel, we should bless the Lord. And that's a choice. to design this notebook yourself. Turn it out. It is different. It's pretty neat. When she was sick, she spent time making it. Fuck. And this one too. I see that because you made it. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday 